I thought we, we played pretty good baseball against Delaware. I thought we, uh, you know, had three competitive starts from our rotation guys. I thought we played pretty good defense. And the first two games, we came up with some big hits. You know, a couple home runs, a couple, uh, you know, late inning, uh, late inning rallies to kind of put ourselves ahead there. Uh, played a really clean game on Friday night. Uh, Sunday, you know, we played pretty good. We just couldn't come up with the big hit we needed to, to get the sweep that was in front of us. But overall, I thought we played uh, pretty good baseball. Uh, question the last couple of weeks Nick's been uh you know terrific you know he went up against some good pitchers you know went up against uh Aaron Savali at Northeastern and, and Marinaccio from Delaware two of the better pitchers in the league and those guys don't give you much margin for error and I think Nick was uh, certainly up to those challenges you know I think he's he's commanded the ball great you know he's he's been able to be at the bottom of the strike zones been able to get to both halves of the plate you know he's got a good slider uh he's thrown some you know his changeups come around for him the last couple of weeks he's He's pitched. He's pitched fantastic. It's been well deserved. Uh, his recognition from the CAA. I just had a really nice season up to this point. You know, I think he's, uh, you know, certainly solidified our, our our DH position. And like you mentioned, he, he just gives us really consistent bats. You know, I think he's uh, he's commanded the strike zone really well. You know, he's willing to use the back side of the field. He's got, uh, you know, he's got some power when he gets his pitch. So he he's had a he's had a really good season. He's been a a big part of a lengthening length, lengthening out our lineup. You know, whether it's uh, getting on base in front of those guys when he was hitting towards the top of the lineup or now hitting behind Cullen and Charlie in the middle. He's giving us good at-bats, uh, you know, wherever he's been. Sure, yeah, it's always nice to uh, recognize the seniors before the last home game, which we'll do this weekend. Um, you know, proud of those guys. It's, uh, you know, it's a great achievement to, you know, contribute to a program like this for four years. There's been some guys that have done some great things here, you know, whether it's uh, on the field or, or some of their leadership stuff. They've been a big part of uh, the team success uh, throughout their time here, so it'll be nice to recognize them before the game, before their last, uh, before the last home games here this weekend. Talisman's uh, played very well, um, you know, lately in CAA play. Obviously, picked up a series win against College of Charleston uh, just last weekend. Got some really good offensive players. Uh, Paul Aselli, uh might be the best offense player in the league. Uh, Palacios had a really good freshman year for him. Can run, can do some different things. Uh, Henzi, some of those guys, you know, they got some. Uh, some pretty some pretty good offensive players and like you mentioned they, they really scrap you know a team you gotta you gotta play all nine nine innings against you know I think they're they're feeling pretty good about themselves right now you know so hopefully uh you know we can continue to play the type of baseball we have been you know we kind of take care of our our own end of things with the pitching and defense and continue to you know try to have the best at bats we can this weekend <laughs>